guys, welcome back to today's video. Um, recently I uploaded a genocide video, if you can't tell that is obviously fake, but still. Um, we're here in Amphion, because a lot of people are saying this, the, um, the cave and the thing could, it's 100% Lugia, that's what people are saying. I'm here to suck down that theory, everyone's been saying that, but like, I know that that could be true, not be true. I'm backing it up with some evidence that I have found, okay? So first off, we're going to walk over to this guy over here in Anthean City. See, this is the guy who sorts down this fairy completely. We're going to talk to him a second. Have you heard the story of Lace the Ace? See, he's an old pilot that once went... Sorry. See, he's an old pilot that was once flight... But once when she was spot... I'll just let you read it. Strange Sky Snake that points out to one Pokemon that a lot of people will be thinking who flies in the air right now and who looks like a long nice a s s bloody hell I can't speak today sorry a Sky Snake Rayquaza I'm 100% guaranteeing right so let's keep on reading Now, here's what he says, mysterious air current. Now, if you guys do not know what that means, there's an ability called Delta Stream that Re Mega Requaza has when it Mega Revolves. It takes away all the flying weaknesses, but it says mysterious air current. Here is where the Lugia Fairy for that cave is completely shut down. There's another bit in um, Rose Cove which will point to it. However, it says he landed on Rose Cove Beach. Hint. So you've retired after that and all that. Um, so, um, that is basically it for that theory. So we're only two minutes in the video. So that's, if you read all that, then well done to you. But you'll understand what I'm, what I'm talking about here. This is what I'll say when people are like, um, Lugia is just like obviously going to be in that cave. That's what people are saying to me. And I was all like, that could be wrong because people say it's all from the games. Just because they're in the games doesn't mean they're in every single game. Like, you can maybe find a Pidgey some in one place and then find them later on in a different place. So they can move around and also it isn't an official Pokemon game as well. I'm not saying Lugia won't be there because here I have some fairies why it could be there too. By the way, this is my new team that I'm EV training. I don't know what to evolve EV. Leave your comment. Leave what you want EV to evolve into in the comments below, and I will evolve into that. So, let's go and now fly to Rose Cove Beats. By the way, I'm also getting a microphone from my phone, so I will have better recording quality sound. Like I know my audio is quite crap, so I'm gonna walk down here. <coughs> Um, and also if any YouTubers watch this video and want to make a video about it, give me credit, just saying. Um, I just want to say two things as well. It could mean it's over there. However, it, I'm not going to walk over there, but if you look directly in the distance, over there, there is another cave, so... Wait, is that a cave? I don't know. Is that actually a cave? Let's go have a quick look at that. Let's put a repel on. Do we have any repels number one? Let's check we have some repels. We think we said have some repels. If we don't, we'll buy some because it can be quite boring to watch a video of, without repels. And you guys know how annoying it is because everyone's seen videos without. Well, doubt. Oh, God's sake. I'm literally getting sick of YouTube notifications. Um, But anyway, so now we're going to surf. Anyone else have this glitch when they go over here? Like, it takes hours to get over there. We're just going to talk on the way there because I don't know how to cut it out on phone. Like, the stuff for phone recording thing, it's just, like, disappointing, to be honest. Um, anyway, so. Um. I'm going to talk a bit more about this, Lu um, why Lugia could be around there. Um. In the main bit of the cave, there is a part, right, of it. I'm not saying that Humpson is, but it could be. See, we're just heading over to that over there. We also see what that is. 
if I'm right, yeah, it's just a Pokeball over there at the moment, but I'm still think I'm still going with my gut, like there's three things there. Now, here is my theory supporting why Lugia could be around there. Not saying there is, not saying it's not. Same with Rayquaza, not saying it is, still not saying it's not. Can't guarantee it, but what the evidence points out to it being, I think it w Rayquaza will be a Rose Cup, not Lugia. I'm guaranteeing it. And the bits that's going to be crap, with Rayquaza, and there's all, it kind of also points to Lugia. I can't remember how many there is. If there is two, if there is enough, there is, I think there's three posts in that. Jesus Christ, it's taking hours. Alright, no, that's how you do it. That's how you get rid of the glitch, apparently, guys. Alright, so. Right, there is an actually cave over here. I thought there was, but anyway. Oh my god, yeah, like, not fully dissolving the glitz, but still. There we go. Um, Let's see what item it is over here. I've actually not got this item yet. That's actually quite bad of me. It... Oh, Pearl. What does that do? Let's see. Oh yeah, cheap thing in swaps. Um, let's go for another surf. Right, now we're going to fly off to where we're meant to be for the rest of this video. It also appears that that's how you get rid of the thing glitch, like when if you go into the oh my god. Um, but Lugia could be over here, so I'll put in all the things in the description what point to skip to. Unless you want to hear the information, then that's alright too. I'd recommend hearing the information, um, but like skipping it, I would recommend also skipping it to the, like where the point that I see. So if you want to skip it, I'll put it in the description, but it also points to where my theory is, because, right, I actually think Lugia, oh, yes, um, I still think Lugia that will not be in that cave, no matter what, I don't think it will be. It has a strong chance to be. However, it does so. Articuno and Sapdos and Moltres, this is also another theory of how to get Lugia. I think you need them first, because if people realise, you actually need, yeah, you don't need them, but still, um, in the main get, in the thing, like, main, like, episodes of it, as we call it, um, Lugia actually is, um, the ruler of all three birds. Also, I'm uploading this video early, so I just want to say that, because I'm getting back on the time with my videos these days. Um, but Lugia owns all three, like Lugia like keeps all the three birds intact so they don't fight. Um, also in Pokemon Go, I don't think I'll be getting Moltres. Don't have to play Pokemon Go. If you want to see Pokemon Go on the channel, put in the description. But the best thing I think I've ever caught in my, the best thing I think I've ever caught. It's a 43 CP Snorlax, and that wasn't the best day. Um, um, yeah, it's just taking hours now to get over here. This is actually kind of stupid. They need to fix the squirts. Um, I don't know what it is. It happens to... I've seen it before to other people. If you have the same problem, then please, like, leave it in the comments and, like, try and get the developers to do something. But anyway, um, I do think that this, what will happen is, if you, um, if we can get Lugia in the game, then it won't be a bad Pokemon, but remember, though, what would Rayquaza do? If they don't make Rayquaza roaming, no, Battle Instinct has been destroyed, because all you need, you don't even need a Mega Stone on Rayquaza, this is the problem with him. He has almost 800 base stats, I think. Then if you EV train him, full attack, full speed, that's going to be over 600 attack, I think. And then add a life orb to it, that's how you just destroy it, I think. And then if you want to go well overkill, Sword Dance or Dragon Dance, boost your speed too. In my opinion, two Pokemon that need to make roaming 
Diog, not Diog, sorry, um, new to, and Rayquaza. I'm not a big fan of Rayquaza. Gotta admit, hate the thing. How long does it take? It's taken us like over ten minutes just to surf around here. Most of this episode is going to be surfing, surfing. I can't talk. Oh my god, how does it bloody take? Look how far we've actually gotten though. Like this is almost nowhere. Right, we're almost there anyway, so here we go. We just sped up a bit. Right, here we go. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Right, we're almost there. <laughs> we are so close right now. And we are there. So, that was put at 11 am, but anyway. That was actually perfect time for my car to run off to. Um, <coughs> so now, this... It, Amazing music. Let's listen to the music a second. Oh yeah, that's right. My music doesn't work. Um, I know what it is. Look, my music's up. So straight. Wait, I put my audio off of now. No, see, well, nothing wrong with it. But anyway, um, so we're just now gonna run down here because I know we're not. We're gonna hover. We're gonna fail at hoverboarding. It'd be quicker to run down here, but screw running. Here is where my second theory lies to why Lugia could be in here. You can see here, there is a put that there is um, a wish thing. Now, I'm not saying anything, but it then up there, there is two flames. Then we have to look over here. What do we know that is here? That right there is the main center for um where or what do you call it? From like ju the Juraxi thing, like Juraxi, yeah, can't talk. Um, now what people are saying is Lugia will come out of there. However, there's two fi there's two problems with this as well. Look how far away it is. Number one. Also, Lugia will come right out and smack its head both on them, and I don't think they can fit fit the sprite in to that small space. Vikwaza is normally just like quite thin, so they will probably will be able to fit the sprite in there too. Also, I'm quite well dressed, just want to say, but that is my theory. I actually think Vikwaza will be in there, not Lugia. Okay, I just want to say that massive. Um, I'm actually like, I've completely forgot about this cave. I think a lot of people did too when it was first released, but I went here anyway, so. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Remember to hit that subscribe button. Um, have a fantastic day. Um, sleep well if you're in the UK. Sleep well tonight. Hope you're all having a fabulous... If you're not, have a fabulous day. Peace.